After what has felt like a lifetime, the reunion we've all been waiting for has finally arrived. Get your gym, tan and laundry on because it's t-shirt time and the cabs are here. Paulie DJ, Wow, Snooki, The Situation, Ronnie, Vinny and Dina are back and this time the Guidos are bringing a little roommate action to Miami. Here's what happened when the most important housemate returns to the house. And then Nicole decided to steal something from the house. Because I'm a criminal. Yep. Facts. Why don't you show them? You cannot have a Jersey Shore house without the duffel. Did you miss him? I did. I'm just relieved that Nicole's not the only one in the house with duck phone lips. It's a duck, guys. It's a duck. Zayn has finally stopped talking to his pillow and is back on the gram after one day. It may have been speculated that his recent Insta clear out was due to his split with Gigi Hadid, but in fact, is there new music on the way? Judging from his only post which arrives Saturday night, it looks like Zayn 2.0. The long awaited action movie will be coming to your devices on the 12th of April, because literally that was the only thing clear about this post. The cliffhanger date at the end has fans guessing, but despite the clarity, even with the angry actors macho fight scene and some dramatic nouns, Z fans are so ready. Leaving Instagram and returning before the sound of music is a very swift, Taylor Swift that is, thing to do. But hey, it's best to take precautions so that the new stuff gets the attention that it deserves. As if the leak track in March and your own website crashing isn't enough, let's just hope April's better to use aim. There's now a royal wedding plate commemorating Meghan Markle's wedding to Ed Sheeran. Wait, what? Move over Prince Harry, there's a new ship in town. Yep, a royal wedding plate just surfaced on Etsy to celebrate the marriage of Meghan Markle, not to Prince Harry, but to another British ginger, Ed Sheeran. We don't all look the same, okay? Whether you choose to eat your toast and Marmite, Harry's favorite snack from it, or hang it on your wall, this plate won't fail to raise a smile and evoke pride in our country's most cherished couple. You heard it here first, forget Hagen, it's all about Med? No, Mirren? I forget it. If Ed ends up playing the wedding on May 19th, he has to get the couple this is a wedding gift. Khloe Kardashian might be giving Bay Tristan Thompson a few slaps on the wrist after his recent antics. Videos have just surfaced of the NBA star allegedly cheating on Khloe whilst away in Manhattan with his basketball team. He was seen kissing a mystery woman in a club and heading off to his hotel with her. Witnesses told Page Six that Thompson was seen looking around cautiously whilst holding the door open for her before they entered the hotel lobby. It's been reported that the pair spent about four hours in the hotel before leaving together in a black SUV. Hours after this story broke, another video had been published by TMZ showing Tristan in a club, kissing and frolicking with two different women back in October when Chloe was just three months pregnant. By the looks of things, he was having a lot of fun, so much so that he forgot there were cameras in a nightclub. Chloe Grace Moretz has just confirmed her split with Brooklyn Beckham. The 21 year old was spotted heading inside a movie theater and she wasn't wearing her ring with Brooklyn's initials on it. Brooklyn was recently seen with Playboy model Lexi Wood smooching her face off, so that's probably why. He also used to wear a ring on his left ring finger with Chloe's initials on it, but that could quite possibly be in the bin now. Time for your daily Khloe Kardashian update. Following the allegations that her partner Tristan Thompson had cheated on her, it's rumored that Khloe is going to stay with him and work on rebuilding their relationship. A source told People Magazine, she's a hopeless romantic and she'll try to make this work. She tried forever to make it work with Lamar. She's having a child with Tristan and she's going to try and rebuild this. Meanwhile, Tristan isn't faring so well. When the basketball player got off the bench to join his teammates in a game against the New York Knicks, he got booed in his hometown. Lol. Finally, Lamar Odom and Chloe's ex, you know, the one who also cheated on her, apparently feels terrible for Chloe. How very big of him. Bella Thorne has revealed that she gets paid $65,000 for a single Instagram post. That's right, with a well-lit single selfie of a sultry smile, she makes more than the majority of people would make in about three years. In a new documentary about her life from Vogue, she says, for grid posting, it's 65 grand a post. She adds, for story posting, it's anywhere from 10 to 20K, and for Snapchat, it is the same as Insta Story. This is how she could afford a $2 million mansion with six bedrooms, six bathrooms, a pool, and a massive backyard, which I guess makes total sense, like, it's really an investment in her career. Everyone knows you can't post Instagrams with the same background twice. Gotta keep those 17.3 million Instagram followers happy.